thing is it's a evaluation camp. So, you know, some people are going to look at wins and losses and how is that going to be affecting how you guys are feeling. It, it, that, that, you throw that out the window right now. It's still you're putting some kids in spots where they either can uh, you know succeed or fail. And uh, it is a pure evaluation situation. Um, I thought the kids competed hard all the way through. There were some untimely goals, but overall they competed. There's a lot of good hockey players. Every kid that's here is a very, very talented hockey player, and they're going to be good hockey players in the future. And it's just the unfortunate part of it right now where you're trying to uh, trim it down a little bit to get a better look at other players. Uh, the kids that are going to be sent home, they're, it's by any means, are they off and not an option? They'll definitely be looked at. Uh, there'll be a lot of contact, and like I said, they're, they're tremendous hockey players. In your mind, is the difference between those who stay and those who don't, for the most part? It's very close. It is. You could, we could stay in there for hours and, and continue to talk about it, and we will. And it, it is hard, uh, but you do have to get to a point where you can start to evaluate some other players. Yeah, it's a huge, it's, I mean, it is a huge benefit. Um, you know, and I, I think it's... You mentioned the goaltending. It's hard for goalies to jump into this. It moves out from there. It's hard for defensemen to jump in, especially if you're a defensive defenseman or uh, not the pure offensive guy. It is hard because there's not a lot of structure. We didn't put a lot of structure in right now. We wanted to uh, see how these guys were going to play and react and, and uh, let themselves make decisions for us. Uh, I think that summer hockey, you know, you're used to doing and trying different things. I think you don't have coaches telling them and reminding them to move it quickly. Um, but also there's not options at times and we haven't given them any structure uh, for them to have an option So what's their first thought when they look up the ice? Sometimes it's not there because we haven't given any, any kind of uh, Direction on what they should be looking for so there. I don't think there's a lot of concern I think the, the con concern would be is if we are giving them some direction uh, and then you don't see it um, But I, I don't think there's much concern Have you identified any four pairs like two guys on the line that you like together amongst the two no, not, re not, not really. We're just trying to identify who can the centers be. Uh, and then from there, take because we have a lot, of, we're very fortunate to have so many centers who, who can play and move to the wing. And uh, from there, we'll start developing some sort of chemistry with, with what can some of the pairs be and some of the lines be.